In this small village of Webo in southern Benin, garbage is worth gold. Here, residents don't just throw away trash. They instead sort it and deliver it daily to a biogas waste processing center run by Ribin. Ribin, a Swiss foundation for sustainable development, built the 1.3 hectare facility, which every week turns around six tons of organic waste into 200 cubic meters of biogas, saving some 164 tons of wood from being used to make charcoal. The center, which opened late last year, also plans to produce around 400 tons of organic fertilizer per year. So far, around 100 households in the area have signed up for the scheme to deposit their waste at the center on a daily basis. We are asking households, families and institutions to bring us their waste, especially organic waste. What is called household solid waste, we will pay them. Every 10 kilograms of waste fetches 250 CFA francs or 57 cents in US dollars, which is paid either in cash or credit to buy biogas. The fuel is a precious commodity in a rural region where electricity remains scarce. I learned that they can turn garbage into gas and other things. So I decided to support this development work by collecting and recycling garbage to take advantage of the benefits. The center has treated more than 20 tons of waste since it began operations late last year. Benin is Africa's fourth biggest exporter of pineapples. And in Uwebo, which has one of the busiest markets in the region, local sources estimate that more than a ton of waste is generated every day from that fruit alone. Waste is no longer a puzzle. It's no longer a problem. Waste is an opportunity. And as I like to say, garbage is hard gold. In this sense, when you add value to it, then it really becomes good, an opportunity. The rest of the treated rubbish, which has totaled more than 20 tons since the end of 2017, is provided by a local garbage collection NGO, Astom. The objective of this foundation is to put in place a real economy that serves the people and protect the environment.